Hello everyone. I want to show you how to use, how to grade your scene's color. This is the uh, part three: the color settings, the color grading, color grading is known as a post production in CG renders units always do post produ product production after uh, render your scene using 3d max or maya post productions uh, will be done using adobe adobe photoshop adobe photoshop in unity you can do post post production or color grading directly uh, using image effects here you can see the original source of the lighting box color grading using post processing stack 2 as you can see it's too hard to adjust your scene color grading Lighting box will help you to get control over most important effects and easily reach to your desired quality and rewards. The first part is exposure. Will increase your scene exposure. We have same options in Adobe, Adobe Photoshop exposure. You can increase your exposure here or here easily. The lighting box slider is more uh, easier or more simpler to use. This is not too much easy to use. Another option is contrast, contrast. You can increase your contrast. Also, in the Photoshop, you can increase your contrast from here. Another option is saturation. You can create a black white effect. The same thing saturation, increase the color, reduce the color. This is very useful for filmic lighting, color grading. You can reduce the saturation for filmic color grading. This is the temperature to add uh, temperate into your scene. Useful for warm. Since this is a auto exposure or A adaptation. This is the adaptation effect. Default value is good enough. You can turn customize it from here. Auto exposure. You can customize the minimum or maximum brightness. Or you can totally disable it. If you use the uh, same value, you can disable. What the expression? This is another useful. Another useful. option is gamma you can increase gamma for interior lighting when you in increase it gamma you must increase the contrast to fix the lighting as well. uh, I want to reset to default
Okay, if you want to create a filmic style color grading, you can use the lift color. Using this option, you can easily create a filmic style lighting. For example, for example. For example, for example, what happened in my ambient lighting? What happened? Okay. We want to go to the next scene. Okay, this looks good now. Now we want to create a filmic style color grading. You can select a uh, blue color as a lift color. Lift color means the shadows color, shadows color or lift color. The gamma color means the uh, whole scene color. You can customize it get a filmic style color grading also reduce the saturation to get your desired results the contrast useful You can choose the tone mapping type. This is the tone mapping type. The AC yes used in most next gen games, Battlefield for Uncharted for and most next gen games use it ACS tone mapping. Okay, here you can customize your uh, foliage shaders. For example, you can convert your textures to default speed tree. As you can see, uh, we don't have any translucency effect. If you want to convert your textures quickly, automatically, to translucency you can convert all shade all speed tree shaders and your custom shader. You can enter your custom shader path to convert it using batch convert to translucency shader. The translucency shader is from lighting box nature and I'll leave a standard pin supper. All lighting match shaders is available here. The default shader is speed 3. As you can see, speed 3 quality is not too much realistic because, because don't have any translucency. You can convert your textures to translucency. This is the translucency intensity. This is the ambient light intensity for translation. Translucency. This is the shadows for translucency effect. You can customize your uh, 
transulency to reach to your desired results. This is the transulency color. The white value is good for me. Here is wind scale speed. You can customize the wind for your wind for your scene. Here is for controlling snow. I will show you in the and a separate video about how to use a snow controller for your scene. As you can see, lighting box is too much amazing to make a realistic scene without lighting looks without any experience. Okay, I hope you enjoy it.